welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome and if you're back mm -mm, kisses my name is rosie for short and today i want to share with you my june favorites today i am in my bedroom and right now this is the new decor area i'm still not done i still have to add a few more things but i added i can and i will as an inspiration and i'm trying to make it really nice and pretty and i still have other things that i have to add and yes my bedroom is a little bit related to that so i'm gonna be talking about a few items about beauty and also home and decor so without talking anymore let's begin so let me start by sharing my beauty favorites and one is this hairspray by not your mother's and again this is the third month that i mentioned this brand because i just like that they are cruelty free and two because i just like how these products work on my hair they're mostly for all hair types and i really like the effect on the hair so i got this one which has apple blossom and bamboo and the other one again by not your mother's is the hair mousse so just to let you know a little on how i use these these are the ones that i have been using really often so the hairspray is the one that i use mostly on those days that i do any type of hair updo like a ponytail like a bun anything that i just want to keep my baby hairs away and i just want my hair to look nice without making it look messy and then this one is the one i use on those days that i want my hair loose my hair is naturally wavy so when i'm just getting ready i really don't like spending a lot of time on my hair i just want something quick fast so these are the ones that i use and then the one that i shared last month which was the red bottle spray which is for the heat that's the one that i use on the weekends most likely either friday night or saturday morning that's when i straighten my hair but other than that on weekdays i just have my hair normally wavy and that's what i do i really like both of these so i wanted to share them with you guys <laughs> okay now the next favorite we're gonna be getting into the home decor so basically is something that i gave my boyfriend george as a gift and this is something that i found on amazon's interesting section where you get to browse and you get to find things that are cute and that look different and well this is where i got the idea and basically i gave it to him as a present because where he's working now he got a new office he got a new desk and i just wanted to give him something that he could place on the desk what i got is a crystal ball and inside the crystal ball is the solar system i thought it was really cute the moment that i saw it and i thought i have to give this to george so i took a mini video because i knew i wanted to share it here i thought it was really cool that it looked really interesting unique and that he was going to really like it and he did i gave him a little note and i was able to film his reaction when i gave it to him and he really liked it so i thought it was a really great gift and i gave it to him for the desk but also because we got to see cosmos on netflix a short while ago and we really enjoyed watching cosmos we learned so much about the universe the galaxy everything so i thought it was a really cute idea that he was going to like and he did the next thing related to home decor as well are these glow stickers so basically these give the effect that when you turn off the lights at night you have stars in your bedroom like if you're looking at the galaxy and i just love it the first night that i put these on i didn't tell george anything and he really liked it so it was a little surprise and just to show you how it looks it brings three sheets of these paper I don't know if you get to see it but it has small stickers the medium size and the really big size 
So far, I have put two of these and I still have this one because I want to add a few more decor items and until I'm not done with that, I don't want to use these that way I know where I'm going to place them but so far it looks really cute and it also brings a moon sticker so it looks like you're looking at the stars and the moon when you turn off the lights and it was a really affordable option. I looked at a few and the other ones were more expensive so i decided on this one because it was the cheapest and it had really good reviews as well so if you're looking to add something different and something creative then i recommend these and i love how it looks <laughs> my next favorite is also about home decor and it's this little lamp and what i'm doing here with the decorating is that i'm going with something modern but simple and fresh and well i thought this was really cute that i found on amazon and by the way i think almost everything is from amazon so everything is going to be in the description box and i got this because we just wanted to add some light to the bedroom and it's really small and it has this button to turn on and off personally i would have liked this to be more of a control setting whether you want bright light or low light but it's just one bright light and it gives a lot of light considering that it's something small so it's something that you can have on your desk if you want to do homework if you're working on a project whatever it is it has a lot of light for something so small and it was really cheap it was really affordable and it had good reviews so that's why i got it and i like it a lot <laughs> okay next item is this patch plus primer and basically i got this and i want to share this because i think that not too many people know about this but i thought this was something more common well i got the idea i believe maybe from a video or a tv show and basically i went to home depot i asked the guy that i was looking for this and he had no idea what i was talking about he took me to the aisle where they have big bottles and i think it's some type of powder and you have to mix it with water and that's how you can create this but i was just looking for something simple that's something that anyone can do and you can do it fast so again i just went on amazon i looked it up and i found it and basically this is kind of like a cream type of lotion it's white and i've been getting ants and i just wanted to cover the holes where i see the ants are getting in and also the holes that are in the wall i like seeing plain solid walls so i just wanted something that i was able to cover and this was perfect i just grab a toothpick and i apply it wherever i need it and another cool thing about this bottle you can see that it has like a scrape on one side so when you apply you can also make that solid and scrape it on the wall and also on the bottom it has the sanding pad that way you can sand away the wall so it's perfect it's just what I was looking for and I just love this. Whoever came up with this idea, it's so cool. <laughs> and the last thing that I want to share with you guys is something that I found on Netflix. So I was home, I didn't know what to do and on my recommended, I saw something called My Only Love Song and it's a series from Korea. So this was the first time that I was seeing something from Korea. I had never watched anything and the moment that I started to see it, I was like, wow, I like this. First of all, the people who work in this series, they're all good looking. The actresses, they are beautiful and the guys, oh my gosh, they're so hot. I always liked Asian guys, but ever since I saw this series, I think that Korean guys are so cute. Well, to tell you a little about what the story is about, it's about Soon Young. <laughs> I hope I'm saying the 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 name right. But Soon Young, 
Um, she's the main actress in this series. So she's a famous actress, so they're working on a series. So it's kind of funny. It's a series within a series where they're filming and she gets upset because there's a new actress and it seems like she didn't know about it and she gets really upset at the director and so she starts treating everyone really bad so her co-workers the director everyone and because she's so upset she finds a car it's more like a van and it's called boom boom she gets inside the van and she doesn't know where to go she just wants to go away and the van has an integrated gps so the the van it's telling her where to go so she just follows the directions she has no idea where she's going and she gets to a place so when she gets there she thinks that she has arrived at a set that it's a location where the director is basically playing a joke on her because she treated everyone bad but then she realizes that she actually went time traveling really long ago and this is where everything starts getting so interesting it's funny it's a little bit of love so it has a few elements which i really liked and this is where she gets to meet ondal ondal is the guy that she meets and at first they don't get along with each other he thinks that she wants everything her way that she is stubborn and then she thinks that he just thinks about money that all he cares about is money and well the relationship begins from them not getting along and then it blossoms into something romantic in the series you will also see a guy from the Cole family the Cole family has a high position in society and they are rich and basically one of the guys from the Cole family is looking to marry someone and he's i think he's the most funny one out of all of them he thinks he's the most precious man that he's so cute and he just basically wants to find someone to marry and well everything turns out super funny of course i won't tell you what happens in the end because i don't want to ruin it for you this is a series of 20 episodes but i think there could be room for another season we get to see how she reacts to going back in time but it would be great to see the other point of view where we see at the end i i don't want to say anything in case you haven't seen it or you are going to see it that way you know what i mean but it would be great just to see the other point of view but it was great i really enjoyed watching it i saw everything i I think like in three days I just couldn't stop watching it and I really enjoyed it so much and because of that I've been starting to see other Korean TV shows well you guys this is it for my June favorites I hope you really liked it if you did thumbs up and thank you so much for watching as always and I'll see you guys in the next video thank you and kisses bye